objective is secured, sir. Good work, soldier. Make sure the Gek is secured aboard my Vertibird. Yes, sir. I'll have the text come down and remove it immediately, sir. You're certain he's unharmed? Yes, sir. He'll pass out shortly, but we can revive him. Excellent. Prepare him for transport immediately. Right away, sir. So, you're awake. Let's keep this nice and simple. You're going to tell me the code for that purifier, and you're going to tell me now. If you tell me the code, it might be worth your life. But you're really not in a position to be demanding anything, are you? You know why. We can't start the purifier without it. The longer the purifier isn't running, the more people suffer. Now I'm running out of patience, son. I want that code, and I want it now. Very well. We'll just verify that now. This is Colonel Autumn. Are your men in place, soldier? Affirmative, sir. Standing by for code transmission. Your code is 704. Repeat. 704. Confirm and enter. Copy. 704. Stand by, sir. Entering code now. Negative, sir. The code's no good. I just lost another man. Why do you insist on making things difficult? Maybe I should start shooting. How much blood you think you can afford to lose before you tell me what I want to know? Colonel, I have need of you. Mr. President, I have no time for other matters. I'll be with you shortly. Now, Colonel. Yes, sir. I do apologize for Colonel Autumn's attitude. He's been under a great deal of stress lately. I've no doubt that you know who I am. I'm sure you've heard my radio broadcasts. I'd like to have a word with you face to face. I think there are a few things that you and I should discuss. You'll find your possessions in the locker near the door. I'll unlock the way for you. And I'll unlock your restraints as well. I'll be waiting for you in my office. Please don't carry.
Hold it right there. You're supposed to be in that holding cell. You're not going anywhere. There's a full complement of guards in the next room. As soon as I get them, you're going back to your cell. In a body bag, if necessary. On whose authority? I have no records of that. You're supposed to be in a holding cell. What? No one sees the president except Colonel Autumn. Stand right there while I check this out. Uh, Mr. President, I'm sorry to bother you. Uh, this is Lieutenant Williams. I have an unauthorized individual here who says he's supposed to speak with you. I'm surprised to hear from you, Lieutenant. I don't recall authorizing you to contact me directly. Yes, sir. I'm sorry about that. I, I just... Uh, it just seemed out of the ordinary. I apologize. Apology noted, Lieutenant. Yes, I instructed our friend to come up to the control room. No questions, no interference. Am I understood? I understand, sir. Again, I apologize for the interruption. Allow our friend to pass and report to your superior for reassignment, Lieutenant, at once. Yes, sir. Hello. I guess you'd better be on your way. Sorry for the, uh, for the interruption. I guess you'd better be on your way. Sorry for the, uh, for the interruption. Attention to all Raven Rock personnel. This is your president speaking. I've invited our guest from Vault 101 to my office. Please do not impede his progress. Thank you for your cooperation. What do you think you're doing? They're not who they say they are. Get out while you can, before they get you too. They're not who they say they are. Get out while you can, before they get you too. Attention, this is Colonel Autumn. You are hereby ordered to ignore the President's previous directive. The prisoner from Vault 101 is to be shot on sight. I repeat, shot on sight. This is an order. Retreating. Retreating. 